It's raining outside, but it's always tropical here at Kitchen Bravo. Today I'm gonna to show you how to cut up a pineapple properly. Um, there are so many ways to do it. There are so many different gadgets out there that you can go ahead and spend your money on, but you really don't need them. To cut a pineapple is really super simple. First you wanna do is just go ahead and twist off the crown right here. Oh, it smells. Smells amazing. If you can see, it kind of looks a little bit like an artichoke, a little bit of an artichoke heart there, but much sweeter. Mm. All right. Next, you want to tail it. So go tip and tail, top and bottom. So I'm just going to cut one slice off the bottom right here. It's going to give me a nice flat. It's going to give me a nice flat set to uh, pull the pineapple on. And this actually goes in this bowl right here. This is where the cut pieces are going to go. I'm going to go ahead and cut a nice slice off the top as well and that way my knife is just going to go ahead and flow around the sides and this is all i want to do is just cut the rind like this and you're going to see the eyes that are still there that's perfectly normal i'll show you how to get rid of that here in just a moment all of the rind is off that was pretty simple I'll just put that in my collection bowl over here and get all of these other pieces off of my board as well. All right, there, wipe my hands, perfect. Okay, so with the way that the eyes are, you're gonna see they kind of go in somewhat of a pattern here, kind of a diagonal pattern. So I'm gonna take my knife at an angle and just go in at the angle here, like this, very shallow, and then you cut down the opposite side, right here. Keeping that little angle, and it's just to keep the eyes out. That's all it is, right here, right in here. Lovely. Very simple. And you're not wasting a lot of pineapple, so you're just doing like little shallow grooves, making little shallow canals, and you're reserving as much of the fruit as you possibly can. This is a really ripe, juicy pineapple, as you can see. So all the pieces that had the eyes in it, the little seed particles, the little pods, those are all going in the collection bowl as well. There we are. Yep, just like that. So you have a nice little groove right here. And we're just gonna do this all around the pineapple. And if you don't find the lines, it's okay, it's no big deal. You can do little cuts like this here and there. Bingo. Just like this. All the eyes are removed and you can see we've got a really pretty ridged pineapple right here. All right, the core is very tough and fibrous, so the easiest way to remove that is to cut the pineapple in half. And then you wanna cut it in half again. There we are. Turn it on its side. Let's see here so you can see better. And I'm just gonna angle my knife at a 45 degree angle and cut that core right out. All right. So here you have it. Now I like to have some tidbits, some pineapple tidbits, you know, some pretty decent sized chunks. And that's exactly what I'm going to do is cut the pineapple in half again. And here we have beautiful, fresh pineapple chunks right here into the bowl. You can leave it in rings or half circles, however you like. If you don't want to cut the core out, you certainly don't have to. This pineapple also freezes really, really well. I'm using the desserts. Put it in the freezer, save it for a rainy day, much like today, but 
I've got the fresh thing here. So here's how we cut a pineapple, here's how we do it, and check Kitchen Bravo for more tips and tricks. All right, enjoy.